The second law of thermodynamics, entropy, is commonly understood as order tends towards disorder. Now that's not extremely accurate. In technical terms, it would go something like an isolated system must always arrive at a state of thermal equilibrium where entropy is at its highest. Well, must this always be true or can we bend the laws of physics somehow and reverse entropy? In 1867, Maxwell proposed a thought experiment called Maxwell's Demon, which seemed to reverse entropy. But before all of that, what is this entropy business all about? Let's say you have a box with some particles. If these particles have energy, the particles would usually tend to a smooth, spread out state. Now it won't matter if the particles are like this or like this, it is still counted as a spread out state. These particular configurations are known as the microstates. Well, what it overall looks like is known as the macro state. Now, if there is a great difference in the macro state, it is known as a low entropy state. And a smooth macro state is considered a high entropy state. Thus, we can define entropy as the amount of available energy a system can provide before it reaches the most probable state of thermodynamic equilibrium. If you wanted to connect this to information theory, entropy is basically the amount of hidden information based on thermodynamic knowledge only. What this basically means is that you can exchange information for entropy. So here we can see how entropy isn't exactly disordered. According to us, this looks pretty ordered, but in reality, this is just one of the several microstates of a high entropic macrostate. Okay, so that's all about entropy, but physics won't be fun without creating seemingly rule-breaking ideas, right? Enter Maxwell's demon. By demon, Maxwell meant a supernatural being, not a modernized demon or something. Now imagine this demon is sitting on top of this apparatus. Two boxes with some high energy and low energy particles connected with a slit in the middle. The demon above controls the slit in such a way. Whenever a high energy particle from the left side comes in contact with the slit, the demon allows it to pass. While whenever a low energy particle comes in contact from the right side, again he allows it to pass. After some amount of time, all the high energy and low energy particles would be sorted and we can now extract energy from this system. We went from a high entropy state to a low entropy state. So did we just reverse entropy? Is the second law of thermodynamics incorrect? This is the Maxwell's Demon Challenge and we'll explore the answer in the next video. Till then, feel free to drop down your guesses and answers in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.